I'm gonna be honest with you folks, musicals have, haven't have always been my thing. I've come around, I've come around and, and appreciate them more and more nowadays. Hi, welcome back to the channel. I did get a chance to watch uh, Star is Born, the 2018 remake, and I gotta say it was incredible. But yeah, I'm gonna tell you all the details about the film, but first take a minute to, to think about this. Consider subscribing to the channel. We're on our way to 500 subs. This channel's a whole lot of fun. I love your guys' feedback. Let's keep it up. All right, and with all that out of the way, let's talk A Star is Born. I rewatched it uh, just last night. First chord that struck with me was the performances, of course. Bradley Cooper, who is not only in stars in this movie, he directed it as well. And I gotta say, he is a talent he is a talent and it's a shame because i've seen him at award shows on t on tv of course i've seen him you know golden globes the oscars and he just always seems to be you know comes up shorthanded but his work speaks for itself and here he he plays a country rock star named jackson maine he's got a bit of an alcohol problem He's going through the motions as a singer. He has ups and downs. That's the impression we get from him. Uh, the film makes it very clear throughout throughout the runtime that this guy has some personal issues. We don't know all the all the, his whole life story just yet. <laughs> but uh, yeah, this was a fascinating film because it's a combination of a romance some bit of a romance there's a bit of a romance in there between um bradley cooper and lady gaga but we'll get to her in a minute this movie it stands out a lot for so many reasons and i think it i think lady gaga she was nominated for a golden globe and she won in the years past there's been a couple of uh films done with the same name and so this is considered a remake What's so brilliant about A Star is Born is there are main leads come with so much you know, baggage, layers to them that it's spread out. And that's a lot of that is revealed to us, whether it be you know, Bradley Cooper's got um, an alcohol problem, he's popping pills. So there's one night where... Bradley Cooper stops at a local bar. It's drag night. It's Friday night. You have uh, men in drag uh, singing karaoke. And then we get introduced to Allie, played by uh, Lady Gaga. Something about her that that can steal you know, the spotlight from any other actor in the same movie. But I'm torn. I'm a little bit um, indecisive based on what I've seen of her acting abilities it seems like her her music her her voice really overshadows her acting chops a lot um and the stars born in this role as ali is no exception she is a an aspiring uh singer songwriter and bradley cooper sees that right away he gets to know her they connect have this connection, this hidden connection. Uh, obviously, as an audience, we see that their relationship, their chemistry keeps this movie afloat and it's enjoyable to see them grow. I think as an artist, Lady Gaga still has a lot to prove uh, if she wants to make it in the movie industry. I know she has an upcoming film, The Joker 2 with Joaquin Phoenix. But yeah, it takes... You know the right talent, or you know the right director to push her as an artist. Bradley Cooper is a, a great start. He understood the assignment. He knows who knew her talents coming in to this role. Guys, let's wrap this video up. I'm gonna give A Star Is Born my final grade B plus. <laughs>